Hello friends, welcome back to my channel Mukesh English and this is Mukesh Sony. Friends, in this video, we are going to summarize the important poem titled Shut Down the Shop, composed by the famous poet K.S. Nisar Ahmed. And this poem is prescribed for the second semester BA, Generic English, NEP syllabus under Bangalore City University. At the end of the summary, you will also get the important questions. And for you can also find out all the other lessons, videos, and the grammar videos and the three question paper solution all the links are available in the description box so now let's know about this poem the poem shut down the shop is composed by case nisar ahmed well-known indian poet and writer in Kannada language this poem describes the plight of the small shops which sold many kinds of goods earlier not now earlier with the onset of globalization they are depleting the in number they're increasing number and jeopardizing means to say damaging the shopkeepers livelihood we can see today so many malls etc i mean not name here the goods sold in the malls show the change in the taste of the customers and the strategies of the multinational company to attract the customers the poet sarcastically tells the shopkeeper to shut down the shops on their own since the mall culture will devour them sooner or later the poem discusses how globalization is detrimental detrimental to retail shopkeepers how the retail business is really getting down getting affected by the mall culture so now the summary of the poem the poem shut down the shop describes the plight of the small shops which sells many kind of goods and with the onset of globalization they are depleting the in number and also affecting the shopkeeper's livelihood. The goods sold in the malls show the change in the taste of the customers and the strategies of the multinational companies to attract them. The shopkeeper is trying, the poet says that the shopkeeper is trying to sell the wares of the shop by displaying them for sale. He's putting the board for sale. The wares are scattered. The speaker feels difficulty to sell the content by publicizing them through sale through the sale. The shop is always kept one the, to protect it from sunlight. Wooden planks are at, are attached. The door is so old that if it's closed, difficult to open it. The others should not ridicule the shopkeeper for this embarrassing situation. The poet describes a clock. The octagon shaped clock that refuses to show the time is broken down the handling cobwebs eaten away by the rusting metallic board so this is the description of the shop and this is the description of the trade the business is going on the retail business the condition of the shopkeeper uh, shop, shop in search of new venge, new avenues the shopkeeper's previous employees have left him so now the shopkeeper does not have the, the trained employees which he had already trained them. So ironically, he comments that when patty shops can sell, can sell imported toffees, chewing gums and mesmerizing scent, who would buy if you lend them? Fly covered, lemon, garlic, the garlic, peppermint. The speaker recalls that once upon a time, the street had one or the two shops. That time, the shopkeeper's shop was like a Kamdenu who could give anything and the shopkeeper was a ruler. So, so there's a comparison between the earlier shop and Kamdenu. On the other hand, today, at every step, there's a luxury shop which could supply at your doorstep home delivery system, right? There was a time when this shopkeeper used to supply in the past refined edible groceries without any fraud in weights or any measures. So the shop was swarming with the customers all day and night. Huge queue, crowd of the customers. But today, the buyers hesitate to buy anything from such retailers. 1,000 or two was a huge capital that time. The whole locality was very much attracted. That is a past story of the shopkeeper shop. The change has brought business rivalry. The poet suggests the shopkeeper to shut down the shop before this petty shop could be discarded with contempt. 
otherwise he has to suffer he has to suffer dishonored and ridiculed he suggests him to live his life well like an honorable person in exile hence the poem shut down the shop highlights the struggle of a, of a small shopkeeper in the face of globalization and the rise of the malls the mall culture the poet points that the taste of the customer has changed the multinational companies are using the ma- the many strategies to attract the people the customer so the poem uses a sarcasm to suggest that small shopkeepers should close the shops themselves since the mall culture will eventually consume them so this is a very um, tragic poem so this is how i have summarized the poem shut down the shop written by nisar ahmed now we have few important questions question number 1 how is the shopkeeper trying to sell the sell the trying to sell the wares of the shop the shopkeeper is publicizing the good the goods for sale but they are stale not attracting and not attracting the customers what forced the employees to give up their jobs the increasing competition and the lack of business forced the employees to find out the new opportunities and to get the new job to give up the previous jobs mention few things sold at the petty shop refined edible groceries and fly covered lemon and garlic peppermint are sold at the petty shop why is the shop compared to kamdeno because the small shopkeepers they were the rulers in the street they used to provide all kinds of goods just like kamdeno the cow a mythical indian cow which could fulfill any kind of wishes why should the shopkeeper shut down his shop the shopkeeper should shut down the shop on their own to avoid the suffering dishonor and ridicule as the small shops are depleting in number getting down in number due to the mall culture the mall culture is taking over so friends this is how i have summarized the poem shut down the shop so for all the other videos all the other links you can get in the description box thank you so much for watching this video click on the like button write in the comment box share the video to your friends and they will to subscribe madi please do subscribe my channel thank you so much stay connected with mukesh english